Welcome to the English department. Here at Criselton, we offer two English A levels, English language and English literature. This presentation is about English language only. So if you are also interested in English literature, just look out for our other presentation. You are allowed to take both English language and English literature as they're completely separate subjects. Why might you want to study English language? First of all, I want to stress that it's completely different from GCSE English language. It's a social science and at university, it's often called linguistics. You'll want to study English language because it's fascinating. For example, where does the English we speak today come from? And what has it got to do with the Anglo-Saxons? It's the most widely spoken language in the world, so it is important to study it. English is fun and creative. You might be writing yourself or be interested in a career like journalism. David Crystal, a famous linguist, once said he loves studying and using English just because it's beautiful. Studying English language is also useful. It will help you to understand how writers use and craft their work. You'll develop your ability to analyse and your own ability to write. In English language, we look at topics that are often in the news, topics that people hold strong opinions about. Ask your parents what good English is. Is it important and do you use it? I'm sure you'll find they have an opinion. Lots of our students really enjoy studying gender and we can have heated debates about how men and women use language. So how can you use English language A-level in the future? You can study it in its own right at university. However, you'll also find it supports other subjects where communication is important. Lots of our students also study psychology, sociology or media as there is some overlap in subject content. You'll end up with a wide range of transferable skills that are valued in many jobs. It might be that you are interested in a specifically creative career or one where you directly use your knowledge. So, what do you study? The course has two examination papers plus coursework. Paper one has two sections. In part A, you use your skills to analyse how texts are created. In section B, you write an essay about how children learn to speak, read or write. Paper two covers a wide range of topics, such as, how does your age affect your use of language? Does your gender change how you talk? What effect has technology had on our language? Or how has language changed over time? You'll analyse some writing by others and you'll get an opportunity to write your own article. In the coursework, worth 20%, you choose your topics yourself. Your first piece is a piece of original writing. It could be a story, for example, or a piece of travel writing. The second is an investigation. Again, you choose the topic. Examples are, how did Trump's inauguration speak differ from Obama's? Or how has the advertising of Coca-Cola changed over time? So over two years, you will learn to analyse language. You'll explore how each of us projects an identity through our language use, how children learn to read, speak, write, how language has changed. You'll also write yourself and you'll learn to work and research independently whilst carrying out an investigation. I hope we've given you an insight into English Language A-Level. Please feel free to ask any of your English teachers if you have any questions.